Hey y'all, I just made it home. I was home most of the day. Then I had a doctor's appointment this afternoon. And after that, I went and dropped off some clothes to Once Upon a Child and um, different things like that. If you don't know what that is, it's a consignment store that they pay you a little bit off your items. But after that, while I was waiting to get my check and money, um, I was at the semi-annual sale at Bath and Body Works. I thought it started the 14th, but apparently it, I don't know if it was today or yesterday, but it started. So I'm gonna go ahead and show you what I picked up. I did, um, normally I only shop at Bath and Body twice a year. It's at both of the semi-annual sales. I'm honestly thinking I might have to go back to get a few more body washes um, and maybe another hand soap or two, just because I don't think I got enough. Uh, Cause I usually go through about with the Bath and Body, a bottle a month for myself. So I probably will have to go back. I might not. I want to see what I have because I know I have no Bath and Body left. So I'm going to show y'all what I picked up. And I guess if I go back, I'll do another haul. So let's go ahead and jump in. Y'all don't see me do Bath and Body too often. So hopefully this is a new type of video for y'all. Um, I've been trying to figure out ways to come up with new video ideas. If y'all let y'all know of any, let me know in the comments down below because I really desperately need some. So let's go ahead and jump in. Okay, so I guess I'll start with this first bag. I've got two bags. Um, each bag has about five or six items in it. Um, I'll start with the hand soaps, I guess. I only got three of those, which is why I'm kind of thinking it's not going to be enough because you do have um, two restrooms, or not two restrooms, a kitchen and a bathroom, so I do use two at a time. So I'm probably going to have to go back and pick up two. The hand soaps were 50% off. They're normally $7.50. So if you do the math, I'm sure you can figure it out. But I'm going to look on the receipt and see if I can. Yeah, they ended up bringing up $3.75, which was not a bad deal at all. So the three cents I got is the cucumber melon. I have not seen cucumber melon in the longest time. I grew up on that scent. Um, it was something my mom kept around the house growing up and my grandmother. Um, and it just brings back so many childhood memories. Going into my grandmother's restroom when we would stay the night and smelling this was, oh my goodness. So I like the foam and hand soaps better than the regular hand soap. So that's what I picked up. But I got the cucumber melon. And the foam and hand soaps were actually the same price as the regular ones. And the regular ones, they, or they had a different foam and hand soap packaging. But it was only 8 fluid ounces. So I got the one with 8.75 fluid ounces. Plus it had a cuter... cuter packaging. I picked up the fresh lemonade. It smells exactly like fresh lemonade. I mean that you make. It, it smells like lemons um, and I really liked it. It was the same price as the other ones like $3.75. And then we picked up the Island Margarita for the summertime. I feel like cucumber melon could be an all year round scent but these two are going to be more your summery type. Yeah. And this smells like a margarita kind of with some fruity to it. It smells like a lime or something. It smells really, really good. Okay, I got two men's body washes. And I got four body washes for myself. So I'm definitely going to have to go back and pick up some more of that. Um, actually, I think I left one of the men's body washes in the car. But that's okay. I'll show you the one I did get. I got... Um, ocean I believe it was either ocean it was a blue one so just know that and the body washes um I think they were the same price they were all half off I think yeah all half off so I paid $6.75 per body wash I got this one this is the men's capri and it's the scent keynotes are lemon coriander and vetiver I'm not sure how you pronounce those um this has a really nice, like, citrus smell to it. Like, just a really nice overall citrus smell. And I thought Nick would like this one. I'm not sure if I'm going to give these to him for Father's Day because I did get him the Dr. Teal's body wash. I'll link that Father's Day video down below. Um, and I got him the bath salt. So, I'm thinking I might save these for his birthday. I don't know. I might just give them to him. So... Pick that one up and then the other one wherever it went. It must have fell out of the bag because my bag ended up falling over. So I did get one, two, I got six body washes for myself. I didn't realize I had got that many, but I think I got enough um, because I didn't think I did. But I'll go back and get some more hand soaps and if I see any more body washes, you know how that goes. But the first one I picked up was the Bahama 
passion fruit and banana flower. And this one, oh my goodness. It's got, it's really passion fruit. You can't really smell the banana, but you can smell passion fruit. If you've ever had the Starbucks passion fruit drink, this will kind of remind you of that. It's just a little bit stronger. I also picked up the Honeysuckle Peach Tea. And this kind of smells like a, smells like a Lipton Peach Tea. I mean, exactly what the packaging says. So I picked that one up. This one is new, I believe. I got a few off of their new rack that was supposed to be for summer, but they were 50% off. This is Cotton Candy Clouds. This smells like cotton candy all over. You know that, that perfume that everybody used to have in the little pink bottle when we were little growing up, and it was like a cotton candy scented perfume. I can rem not remember what it was called, but it was such a potent cotton candy smell. It smells exactly like it, so I'm kind of reminiscing in my childhood. I really loved that. Um, I picked up the Boardwalk Taffy. That's a newer summer scent. And this one, it kind of smells like cotton candy a little bit, but it's a little bit deeper than cotton candy. It smell, I mean, it smells like cotton candy, but I think because they mixed... Um, that's because it has pink berries in it and whipped vanilla. I think it's because it's got cocoa butter and whipped vanilla in it. It's got a little bit more of a subtle tint than the regular, a subtle smell than the cotton candy does. I also picked up the Coastal Hydrangeas. And this one has Fresh Hydrangeas, Ocean Mist, and Golden Apple. I love that this one. Oh my goodness. It smells like hydrangeas with a little hint of, or a little hint of apple and you really can't smell the ocean but I think because it's got it's not as potent because it's got a little bit of that ocean mixed in there so this one's a really good one so definitely be looking at these when you go in the store for your semi-annual sale or anytime and the last one I picked up was the pink tie-dye I thought that was really cool because everybody loves tie-dye right now and this one I don't know I liked it but now it kind of smells, I don't know. I don't know how I like this one. I liked it when I bought it, but I think it's because I was smelling all the other ones and this was like the last one I picked up. It's got Pink Lady Apple, Water Lotus, and Cotton Blossom. I think I might end up having to bring this one back because I just don't like this one. This is more like a straight lime and different things like that. So. I probably will bring this one back, um, but yeah, so I hope y'all enjoyed this little Bath and Body Works haul, and I will see you guys next time. Bye.